Hi, and welcome to another WatchGeek Video News. Today, some quick news about a new limited edition G-Shock release that has already been sold out. It's the new DW6900FS. Now, the watch is made in collaboration with McDonald's, and as a big lover of McDonald's burgers, I really like this combo. It's not going to have a horological importance as the release of the Zenith Defy Lab, for instance, but as a fun addition to a collection that will most certainly appreciate in price, it is really great. Now, the reason behind this special edition is the fact that McDonald's is celebrating 50 years of Big Mac, one of my favorite burgers when it comes to McDonald's. So they decided to celebrate it by issuing limited edition caps, jars of Big Mac sauce, and 1,000 specially branded G-Shocks, and only in Japan. Now, at only 1,000 pieces and a very reasonable price of 14,900 yen, which is around $136, it becomes clear why it took seconds for all of them to be sold out. Now, those who managed to snag one can consider themselves pretty lucky, as prices on eBay have already reached, and in some cases passed, $500. Now, the funny thing is that the only time when I managed to make four times the amount I paid for a watch was also in case of a limited edition G-Shock. So these are always a pretty good investment. They won't bring you a lot of money, but percentage-wise, I don't think there are watches that can appreciate as much as fast. Now, is there something special about the watch itself? No, it's just a regular 6900. So battery operated regular G-Shock that has an alarm, a 24 hour stopwatch and a 24 hour countdown timer. So as simple as it gets. The only difference when it comes to the module is the backlight background with a large Big Mac inscription shown when you hit the light button. Other differences are merely cosmetic with a specially designed face that has the McDonald's arches where Casio logo is usually and the band has been made to resemble a cutout of a Big Mac. Also the case back has a picture of a Big Mac together with Big Mac and 50th text engraved on it. The packaging has also been made to resemble a McDonald's order so the tin is made to look like a burger while the outer cardboard box resembles the box you get at McDonald's. All in all, a really fun collaboration that seems very natural, because a Big Mac is just a simple burger, so a piece of food that's gonna feed you and it's gonna taste good. And in the same way, the 6900 G-Shock is just a simple watch, it's nothing fancy, it's gonna tell the time and it's gonna do it reliably for years. I'm pretty sure this is gonna become a very sought after model, not only because of the limited release, but because it actually looks good. Well, at least to me. Well, this pretty much completes this week's news, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like and subscribe. And until the next video, bye.